welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss the question which says that calculate the index number for 1985 taking 1980 as the base year using weighted average of price relative method from the following table. Now here in the table, the various commodities are given to us as A, B, C and D and their corresponding weights are given as 2, 4, 3 and 6 and the price per unit in 1980 for the commodity A is 20 then for B, C and D it is 30, 40 and 50 respectively and the price Per unit in 1985 for the commodity A, B, C and D is 45, 60, 62 and 75 respectively. Now if the weights are now changed so that weight for A is 3 and weight for B is 2 and the total weight is 15 and the value of index number in 1985 with changed weights is 173. Calculate the weights applied to C and D. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know a result. And that is, by the weighted average of price relative method, P01 is equal to summation of P1 over P0 into 100 the whole into W whole upon summation of W which is equal to summation of W into X whole upon summation W where X is P1 over P0 into 100. Now here P01 is the price index number for the current year with reference to the base year W denotes the weights and P1 over P0 into 100 are the price relatives where P1 denotes the current year prices and P0 denotes the base year prices for the given commodities under consideration. Now this result will work out as a key idea for solving out this question. And now we will start with the solution. Now, first of all, by using the weighted average of price relative method, we have to find the index number for the year 1985, taking 1980 as the base year for this let us draw a table for the given data. So we have drawn a table for the given data. And in the first column, we have written the various commodities. In the second column, we have written the price per unit in 1980. That is, the year 1980 is the base year for the year 1985. So, the price per unit in the year 1980 will be denoted by P0 and for the current year, that is the year 1985, the price per unit will be denoted by P1 and in the next column, we will find the price in relatives for the year 1985, that is we will find X which is equal to P1 over P0 into 100, then in the next column, we have written the weights which are given to us and in the last column we will find W into X. Now for the commodity A, the price relative X will be equal to P1 over P0 into 100 which is equal to 45 over 20 into 100 which is equal to 225. Then for B, it will be 60 over 30 into 100, that is 200, 
and for the commodity C, it will be 62 over 40 into 100, which is 155. Then for D, the price relative will be 75 over 50 into 100, which is 150. Now let us find W into X. Now here 225 into 2 will be equal to 450. Then 200 into 4 is 800. And 155 into 3 is 465. And 150 into 6 is 900. Now, the sum of all the values of W will give us summation W which is equal to 15 and the sum of all the values of W into X will give us summation of W into X is equal to 2615. Now using the result which is given in the key idea we can find out the price index number. So the price index number P01 for the year 1985 with 1980 as the base year is equal to summation of W into X over summation of W which is equal to 2615 over 15 which is equal to 174.33 and now if the weights are changed so that weight for A is 3 and weight for B is 2 and the total weight is 15 and also it is given that the value of index number in 1985 with changed weights is 173 then we have to calculate the weights applied to C and D. Now let us draw a table for the given data. Then the weight for A is 3 and the weight for B is 2 and we have to find the weight for C and the weight for T. Now here we have drawn a table for the given data. Now here we have already calculated the value of X and P0 and P1 are also given to us. Now here for the second case it is given that the weights are changed. That is the weight for A is 3 and the weight for B is 2 and we have to find the weight for C and the weight for T. So let the weight for C be Y and the weight for D be Z and it is also given that the total weight that is summation W is equal to 15. Now summation W is 15 that is on adding all the values of W we are getting 15 and by calculating further we get that the weight for D that is Z is equal to 10 minus Y. So here we can write Z is equal to 10 minus Y. Now in the last column let us find W into X. Now here 225 into 3 is 675. Then 200 into 2 is 400. Then 155 into Y is 155Y. And 150 into 10 minus y the whole is 1500 minus 150y. Now from the table on adding the different values of w into x, we are getting summation of w into x is equal to 2575 plus 5y. Now, by the weighted average of price relative method, the index number P01 for the year 1985 
1985, taking 1980 as the base year, is equal to summation of W into X, whole upon summation W, which is equal to 2575 plus 5Y, whole upon 15. Now it is also given that the value of index number in 1985 with changed weights is 173. So this implies 173 is equal to 2575 plus 5y whole upon 15. Further, this implies 2595 minus 2575 is equal to 5y which implies 20 is equal to 5y. And this gives y is equal to 4. Now we have taken the weight for C is y and the weight for D is 10 minus y. Therefore, the weight for C is equal to y which is 4 and the weight for D is equal to 10 minus Y that is 10 minus 4 which is equal to 6. So this is the solution of the given question and that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.